The little Olympic fans gathered on Parliament Hill got to meet the Prime Minister, but they were all there for the big announcement, which Canadian athlete will carry the Maple Leaf in Rio next month. Rosie McLennan, <laughs> Olympic gold medalist from London in 2012, uh, competing in trampoline again this year uh, and representing Canada. McLennan was Canada's only gold medalist in those games. Now she is clearly thrilled at this new honour, leading Canada's 314 other athletes at the opening ceremony. Rosie! 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 Standing here, going into my third games, I'm filled with so much pride and so much gratitude that words can't even begin to describe it. But the 27-year-old trampoline gymnast has had a tough year getting to this point. Last summer at practice, she suffered a concussion after hitting her head on the side of the trampoline. She recovered from that to compete and win gold at the Pan Am Games in front of her hometown crowd in Toronto. But then another hit to the head left her battling headaches, dizziness and light sensitivity. She credits coaches and therapists for helping to bring her back to competition. With the support of everyone around me, I was absolutely able to keep on pushing and uh, there were definitely times when uh, I didn't know if this was going to be a possibility. Canada's chef de mission says McLennan's difficult road to these Olympics make her an excellent choice for flag bearer. Her perseverance, her overcoming of adversity, uh, injuries and concussions that, uh, that have plagued her uh, almost prevented her from competing at the 2015 Pan Am Games uh, where she shone so well. So, you know, she just epitomizes, I think, what actually Canadians uh, look for in their athletes. With flag-waving tips from the Prime Minister, McLennan got to practice the role she will play in two weeks. Ron Charles, CBC News, Toronto.